see me. That's all I, have. I just heard one big you. That's all I heard. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to OKC Improv Student Showcase. Uh, that's Christelle Carizales, our artistic director. Yes, yeah. Kendall Lacey, our program director. And uh, we have a great night planned for you guys tonight. Uh, for those uh, that have wondered, yes, we offer classes. And we have proof tonight with, the, with what, you're there, uh, what you're about to see uh, here on stage. And we have our level four that will be performing. One of two of our level fours are performing tonight. Uh, and then also, you're going to see our level threes performing. And then, of course, we have those people that most of you are probably here to see the first time improvisers yes. that, that are finally stepping on the stage. They're breaking the mold. And you'll never. Like Recognize them again. Them again. No, like them. <laughs> they are forever changed in this moment. How are you so witty? Because yes. I've taken improv class at OKC Improv. So. <laughs> awesome. It's great. Uh, I told my mother. I like to say this for classes. I uh, my mother said I think I'll take improv classes, and I said really, and she said if that's what it takes to see my son, oh. and I was like oh, oh. burned. <laughs> And so that's what these guys are going to be turning into that's now. Right. That's right. <laughs> so yeah, the last time you're ever going to see your loved one again. <laughs> 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 ladies and gentlemen, you, are, you ready to bring out the first group? <laughs> excellent, excellent. Well, uh, they're under the teachings of uh, Anne Lizette Cavani, right? I'm Cavani, saying her name right. right. Yeah, I've, never, I've always wondered if I said her name right, and I did. Uh, and they're going to be doing uh, some short form, which is a lot like what you see on Whose Line Is It Anyways? Uh, a lot of the Wayne Brady stuff you see. And they're going to be very awesome and very funny. Ladies and gentlemen, get your hands clapping. And welcome to the stage. Hello, Pete. Real, 
these are personal questions, so I feel like some people have some burning questions and they're just not answering them. Okay. When will I get married? Oh, oh yeah. classic. We get those one all the time. Yeah. We have actually a really, really long uh, <laughs> individual personal answer for you. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> when will you get yeah. married? Okay. I'm going to start right here. You. And. Your. Beautiful. Lover. Will. Never. Never. <laughs> Stop. Having. Sex. Yes. Yeah. On. The. Table. <laughs> so, so you're not going to get married because you're going to keep having sex. Right, sex. right. right. yes. Yeah. So marriage, we know, it kills that. Works for me. Right, right. One last question. Anybody over here? Uh, just a quick. We, I think we Oh, yeah, we've got time for one more. Anybody? Oh, right back here. Yeah. Why can't I get coal off my mind? Oh, no. Oh, that's a difficult question. Why can she not get someone in pole off her mind? Um, we're going to start down here. When you see coal, you love to puke <laughs> many times from your mouth. <laughs> yeah, so, because he's, he's uh, evoking a personal emotion that you're vomiting every time, so he's got to be on your mind, obviously. Yeah. So great job on our experts. Everybody give them a round of applause. Um, this next game is for Lindsay and Cole. We're going to just pause on the side of the stage there. And um, we need a couple volunteers for this game. Just super easy. Who wants to help out? Um, you little girl. This little, oh, the little one? I'll take her, too. Uh, How about both little girls? You want, I just want to help on a game? I know you guys want to help us. Somebody taps your shoulder, okay? So I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna practice, okay? So today I went to the store and I bought some grapes. Grapes, Aww. great job! Yay. All right, and so um, I'm gonna make it a little harder for you since you're a little older. You can only say let words. You can say any word that starts with the letter. Give me any letter of the alphabet. S. S. Okay, so say anything that starts with an S. Okay. So if I said you like. I went to the store, I bought some grapes, I brought them home, I cooked them in some anything with the S. Shoes. Shoes. I cooked them in some shoes. Yeah. Okay. So Cole and Lindsay are just gonna do a scene. You guys just hang out there. Anytime somebody touches your shoulder, just say a word. It's okay if it doesn't even start with S, it's fine. We'll take it. All right, so can they get a suggestion for any um, act, act, activity that they can do for fun? Just yell it out. Tennis. Tennis. Your suggestion is tennis, and we'll see the scene. <coughs> so are you ready for tennis lessons? Yeah, um, and I broke my racket killing crickets. Oh, that's <laughs> exactly what they need for, so that's okay. Um, we can get you a new one at the... Strawberries. At the strawberry store. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I heard about that, and those strawberry rackets are supposed to be like really, really weak. When you hit the ball, um, this weird thing happens, and they get old. They get, <laughs> they get really old, really, really fast, and you can't even eat it afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> they want to make sure that you have to buy a new one like immediately. It's kind of a scam if they have that one. Oh, you know, when I heard those were like at least, what, $30 each? Strawberries are very expensive. They are, they are. But they're, you know, it's the name brand that you're buying. So we should totally go get some storage. Some storage stuff there. Because um, <laughs> they also have like a storage of other things we can use, like cricket repellent, so that you won't have to use the the tennis racket for the cricket yeah, table. The tennis racket cost me like $120, but I got it from. I <laughs> got it from Prince. From Prince? <laughs> <laughs> I, I heard that. Yeah, and actually Prince is
is an actual name of a tennis company. Okay, great, great. Right? Yeah, I, I'm actually not a tennis teacher. I know nothing about tennis. You know what? So yeah. I just kind of hang out here outside and talk with people because I'm really lonely. I've never, ever in my life played tennis. Then let's Secrets. just not play tennis anymore. <laughs> well, let's go home yeah. and stew. And stew <laughs> in that really, really hot basement we have. That's great. It's the basement. You know, our cats might miss us. Yeah, you yeah, know those cats. <laughs> those cats are living under our house. Uh, you know, under well, the it's basement. Because, because of all the rats and crickets. <laughs> well, That's the fine. cats will eat. So. So. We don't have to. I'm trying to install this speaker system that you brought to me last week, but I'm having some trouble. It's just um, not working. Well, it's upside down for one thing. Oh. Uh, okay. All right. All right. There we go. So the reason I want you to install that speaker in this truck is um, it's got to be a very loud truck. Very loud. Okay. Yes, I like my trucks loud as well. So. Um, yeah, I just like to <clears throat> drive it around the neighborhood and make... A lot of music to the neighbors. They, very good, very good. That. You drive an ice cream truck or? Uh... Um, yep. Um, yeah, I don't sell an ice cream. Yeah. I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm selling license. Very good. Um, All right. Shift right. <laughs> well, I uh, got that report to you that you asked for. I hope it was up to your standards. Yes, it was great. It was really fantastic. But I think you don't need it five pages. Five pages? H how many pages would you like? Um, uh, maybe just a couple. Just a couple? Okay, I'll try to, <laughs> it's, I'll try it's, to truncate. I can be wordy. I'm sorry. It's only a ten minute meeting. <laughs> ten minutes. Okay, yes. I, I don't know why. I, I just like to throw in as much information as I can and it's just, you know, it all, I'm so confused. I only started last week, so I'm uh, can you having some trouble. Can you in English but, uh, this time? In English, <laughs> yes, yes. Sorry, I come from Sweden and uh, I've been on Sweden. We try to put, uh, you know, I, I don't know. But. <laughs> Tina, how are we coming on those deductions? I'm working on another one right now. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get you to the nurse. I hope you can be triplets. <laughs> I, uh, I don't know if I can handle that at this time, but if it'll save me $500 a year, damn it, I'll do it. <laughs> such a good idea to come out here and pan for gold. <laughs> oh, yeah. All I'm finding is, is silver. <laughs> yeah, silver is worthless. Just 
throw the silver over there. That'll be the silver pile. We'll just keep panning for gold. Oh. <laughs> I, I just, I just caught a bass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we can eat the bass. Like a bass pile in a silver pile. <laughs> <laughs> <That's the silver. laughs> okay, sir, your ice cream truck is ready to go. We got the speakers hooked up. Everything's all good. Great. Um, now we need some ice cream. We need some ice cream. Okay. <laughs> I've got my ice cream shop as well. Let me go get some ice cream for you. Here's the standard package. All right. <laughs> All right, one big tub of ice cream and one big speaker. There you go. What's All that, right. I think? I think you're cream? good. You might need a hat, actually. I feel like you need a hat to be the official right. ice cream man. So, all right. Hat, ice cream, music. We're good. I think we're good to go. Let's see if it'll start. All right. Shift right. <laughs> I've got the report here for you. It should oh, be shorter. One page. I got it to one page. Oh, thank you. And it's in English. Yes, yes, I tried very hard. <laughs> <laughs> the, the meeting is tomorrow. Are you ready for it? I, I, th I think so. I got some slides. I, I've got a, uh, I brought my own projector. I made it myself. <laughs> so uh, I hope you don't mind. But uh, I really like to get into this stuff. I'm is very it Swedish? Fun. It is, but I think uh, it'll translate well enough. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Tina, ever since you started having babies for everyone in town, tax, tax business is through the roof. Well, that way we have more and more deductions. <laughs> we can pass them out to other people, too. Maybe we can rent them out. How do you keep having the triplets? <laughs> <laughs> well, I use the postman, the mailman, the milkman. <laughs> chain, sometimes called bell game. These two improvisers are going to play a scene at any moment. If I ring the bell like this, they just have to change what they just said. And I'm going to ring it more than once, FYI. <laughs> so uh, so uh, can I get a suggestion for these two of just, how about um, a physical activity, something that maybe is like hard work. You know? Surfing. 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 Again, you don't have to be surfing. You can do whatever you want. You guys got this. I did. I did. <laughs> 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 Giant blue surfboard. Do you, um, think? do you have anything bigger? Like big. Oh, <laughs> uh, yes. Do you have anything smaller? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> do you even have surfboards? Uh, <laughs> I think we have this one. <laughs> We have one. <laughs> we have other stuff. Okay. Um, surfboards. I don't know how to surf. A surfboard. Okay. Um, do you know how to surf? Could you teach me how to surf? No. <laughs> <laughs> Could you teach me how to dance? Could you teach me nothing at all? Could you teach me um, how to be a woman? <laughs> Be 
a man anymore. <laughs> if I didn't, if I did really want to be a woman and a man at the same time, <laughs> is that possible? I would say you'd be more of a man lady at that point. Okay. I'd say you'd be more of an animal at that point. <laughs> Can you teach me how to be an animal? Um, I came here to uh, you're supposed to be the you teacher. Want the surfboard <laughs> you're supposed to be the man lady. Yes. You're, <laughs> you're supposed to be in charge. <laughs> Come on, man. Just tell me what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> Stinky. Oh. Clara, our love is like pine saw, all sticky and smooth. Oh. Clara, our love is like pine saw. I use it to clean the toilet. Oh. Clara, our love is like pine saw, deadly when swallowed. Oh. Clara, our love is like pine saw, thin and runny. Oh. Clara, our love is like pine saw, the can is empty. Oh. Oh. Okay. All right, can um, we get a, another suggestion for uh, an occupation? Our love is like a therapist, all talk and no show. <laughs> Clara, our love is like a therapist. It has major issues. <laughs> Clara, our love is like a therapist, uh, always putting the other one on the couch. <laughs> our love, Clara, our love is like a therapist. You just lay there on the couch. <laughs> Clara, our love is like a therapist, certified. <laughs> Stapler. You have to fill it and fill it, and you can never get it in at all. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Well, Clara, our love is like a stapler. We're always stuck together. Aww. Clara, our love is like a stapler. Vent at an angle. <laughs> right, uh, occupation someone in your family does? Attorney. Attorney. <laughs> our love is like an attorney. Expensive. <laughs> Clara, our love is like an attorney. Slimy. Clara, our love is like an attorney. Lip service. Clara, our love is like an attorney. We argue all the time. Clara, our love is like an attorney. $55 an hour. <laughs> Clara, our love is like an attorney. Tend to blow things out of proportion. <laughs> okay, um, one more. Let's do another object. Something you don't use very often. Maybe holiday object. Fedora. Is that no. what? No. No. Juicer filled with pulp. Oh. <laughs> our love is like a juicer, seedless. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, our love is like a juicer. Those things are 
really hard to clean. <laughs> Claire, our love is like a juicer. Put it in the attic because no one uses it. <laughs> Sarah, our love is like a juice or a bit fruity. <laughs> our love is like a juicer. It's all sticky. Oh. Claire, our love is like a juicer. It's very expensive and you have to keep putting the fruit in and in and in and in and in and you still don't get enough. <laughs> Clara, our love is like a juicer. I guess you can make lemonade with it.